Hey guys, uh, so this is Friday, May 1st. Um, I wanted to put up your part three of your final exam so that you can uh, start studying for it. Um, so I've got all of this laid out for you and I just wanted to explain this. Um, I've changed everything on here, okay, the, the measurements and all that kind of stuff. Um, this is just for practice purposes um, so that we understand how to find these different things here. Uh, so this is part three of your final exam, okay, so for today um, we have this one page of work to do. This won't be due until Monday, so you have the whole weekend to work on it. If you want to get to me early, you can. Um, but this first section here, we have our given uh, circle G. We've got arc EC is 123 degrees. Angle BGC is equal to 123 degrees. And then using that information, you have to find these different um, degree measurements. Okay, um, We have done this previously in one of the tests. If you have your notes from that, um, that could very well help you. Um, but uh, So take some time and fill these out here. And then down here at the bottom, you've got this um, parallelogram here. Um, and each information is um, all on its own, okay? So one does not relate to another. Um, you just take the information in each... A question and apply it to find the answer for that question okay they're not tied to each other in any way in other words I don't need to know what 7 is in order to find 8 or 9 to, to uh, or 8 to find 9 um, they're all individual questions there okay so take some time copy this down the best that you can and um, honestly um, I, I hope that you're not just uh, some of you are just sending me um, the answers and that's fine um, because I can take that and tell you whether or not you have the correct answers however I hope that you're taking all of these notes down to study properly for the final exam and that you're not just submitting answers and being done with it all of this material is for your own benefit okay uh, so that you can take this and um, properly study for the final exam okay so here is your part three um, take some time and get all of that copied down um, and submit those answers by no later than Monday, okay? Um, and that is part three. I will post part four early um, and part five so that if you'd like to go ahead and get all of that done, um, then you can uh, do that ahead of time. Also, I was considering um, creating a Zoom meeting for us to meet once all together um, before we take the final exam so that if anybody has any questions we can address them all together um, but um, I'm not sure what your schedule is I know some of the teachers were doing zoom with you um, so let me know if that's something that you'd be interested in doing um, and uh, that way we can cover any uh, questions all together and make sure that we are ready to go for the final exam uh, I was looking at the calendar <clears throat> Technically, the 15th is the end of the year, so next uh, next week, really, um, well, not next week, but the following week, uh, is the f Friday is the 15th. So I was considering doing the final exam on um, the 12th or the 13th. Let me know um, what your uh, final exams look like, what days they fall on for your other classes. We've got plenty of time. We can take it even next week. Uh, maybe on the 8th if we wanted to, um, if we feel like we're all ready to go for that, we don't have any questions, um, we can take that next week if we wanted to and just be done with it. Um, so I'm kind of leaving that up to you guys. You let me know which ones you prefer, uh, if you have one date that's uh, preferable above another, or if you just don't care either way. Um, shoot me a text and let me know which day you would prefer to do um, the final exam on and we can arrange that um, as comfortable for everybody as possible. Okay, so uh, that's all I have for you today. Uh, again, here's your part three of your final exam. Um, and this is for your study purposes. So you need to fill out these questions and submit them to me by no later than Monday night. Okay, um, you have all weekend to work on this one. All right, guys, that's all I have for you. And if you have any questions, get with me and let me know. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.